It's been 17 years since the killing of a 10 year old boy and his stepmother shocked the Franklin community. Lake Dickus, Blake Dickus and China Dickus were found stabbed to death in their home on this day in 2006. CBS 4's Max Lewis spoke with family friends who say they'll never give up the search for justice. On the evening of July 24th, 2006, Sean Dickus returned to his Franklin home and discovered his 26 year old wife, China, and his 10 year old son, Blake, dead inside. Both had been stabbed repeatedly. Police discovered Blake had also been beaten and smothered. It was total shock and awe. There was horror. People couldn't believe that it would happen in, in a town like this. To this day, the killer is still out there. In the years since, police have put up billboards and offered a $25,000 reward for information. Hundreds of tips have been called in, but still no answers. Franklin Detective's latest working theory is that the murders may be connected to a string of home burglaries that occurred near the crime scene scene. However, the department declined our interview request today, but did say they remain fully committed to solving this case. We refuse to call it a cold case because that insinuates that there's nothing else to do. John Wales is a close family friend of Blake's mother, Christina, and has continued to raise awareness about the case over the years. It was too painful for Christina to speak with us today. 17 years does not dull the pain. Um, you know, it's, it still hurts. It's still a very painful day for the family. It hurts that there's still no answers, um, but it hurts that Blake is gone. Blake would have been 27 this year. Wales says it's hard to think about that, but he and Blake's family still have hope that one day the killer will be caught. The hope is that someone who knows something will eventually come forward. Anything and everything, any tip that you think, no matter how big or small, no matter if you think it's been sent to the police already, Call the tip line. Get it into the police. In Franklin, Max Lewis, CBS 4 News. There is still a $25,000 cash reward for information that leads to an arrest in the case. We have that tip line number with this story at CBS4Indy.com.